During the height of the lynching era from the 1880s to the 1950s, many white Americans saw lynching as a legitimate means of maintaining social order and preserving white supremacy. Lynchings were often public spectacles, with crowds of white onlookers gathering to watch and participate in the violence, often bringing along small children. One gruesome aspect of the lynching era was the practice of photographing the lynching victims and turning these photographs into postcards. These postcards were often sold as souvenirs or used to spread terror and intimidation among black Americans. The practice of creating lynching postcards began in the 1890s and continued through to the 1950s. These photographs were taken by professional photographers or members of the mob itself, and they often depicted the victim's body hanging from a tree or other makeshift gallows. The postcards were then printed and sold, sometimes with captions or messages of support for the lynching. All of the images here are actual postcards that circulated at the time. 